Well, we've been in the restaurant business for like 30 years. Uh, we have mostly Spanish restaurants. Um, after selling them and moving on and doing a lot of consulting at different restaurants, uh, my kids actually wanted to open a restaurant, so I was like, all right, we're going to open one. And uh, I drive a 1968 red Cadillac convertible that's out front. And uh, they were, let's call it the red Cadillac. So I wanted to prove to my kids it doesn't matter what you call it. As long as the food's great and the drink's great, people will come. So uh, the red Cadillac was born. Um, we do a lot of stuff with tequilas. Uh, our tagline is tacos and tequila. We're a Mexican restaurant, and that's how we roll it out. Um, all the tequilas uh, we make, we have uh, 12 different flavors that are infused here in the house. Uh, mango, hibiscus, uh, orange, mandarin, um, 12 different flavors. All the tacos, all the shells are made from scratch. Uh, there's no cans in the shop. Everything's made uh, with fresh produce, local produce, and uh, you know, we call it a uh, uh, garage Americana theme with uh, Mexican street cuisine. So we're not trying to be anything, we're just trying to make it as fresh and as best as we can. Yeah, that's a picture of my dad in Newark, New Jersey in front of his Cadillac. And he actually sent that to my mom in 1958. Uh, she was in Spain, that's where we were from. And uh, he passed away a couple years ago, so I figured I'd have dad here every day to say hi and bye. Uh, we also have pictures of uh, tacos and uh, the tequila lily. So again, taco and tequila is really what it's all about. Who doesn't love that? Uh, we needed something to put candles in, and uh, we're trying to stay with the automotive thing. So uh, a friend of mine, uh, Mike, owns a motor shop, and we were like, uh, you got any pistons around? And obviously he did, so my wife uh, took them, polished them off, and said, wow, they're perfect candle holders. And uh, we have the candle holders here, we have mufflers. Uh, you know, things are tight on a budget, so we did what we could do. My wife and I decorated uh, the entire place. She's the designer, Wonderful. and I just put things together. All right, so I want to show everybody an example of what Joe did here with the chandelier. He made it out of upcycled silverware. So he basically took something that was on the way out and made it into something better and upcycled it so it didn't have to go into a landfill or anything. And it looks beautiful. Very yeah. decor. Thank you. And these garage doors you were telling me are from your granddad's garage? They're from my granddad's. It was a barn. He had a horse barn in Roosevelt Park originally. He died like uh, seven years ago. Okay. And put the garage doors because uh, I wanted to save something from it in my back of my house. And when we got here, we needed a divider. We were like, we're better than Pop-Pop's doors. So right. It had say to... hello to everybody. So that's uh, the happy hour sign there. A friend of mine had it in his uh, backyard of his sign company and uh, we decided to make that our happy hour. So for uh, regular, we put whatever the gallon of gas is that day. That's our price for regular. And for that, between three and six, any day that we're open, you can get a shot of our infused tequila, regular tequila, or a beef taco. For the plus, 473 today, uh, you can get a pint of sangria, homemade, or two beef tacos. And for the premium, which is 691 today, during happy hour, you can get any appetizer on the menu or any margarita, which chrome margarita is very popular here, made with 1800 silver. We like to call it chrome. Grand Marnier, fresh lemons, fresh oranges. Here with uh, Dan and Amanda. Okay, so we're at the Red Cadillac here in New Jersey. Tell me why you guys come here. What, what draws you to this place? Uh, the people, the atmosphere, the food especially. Uh, everyone's great here. We know everyone. Everyone knows our names, our waiters trying to you know, interact with you. Uh, I love the food, the booze. Joe's a great guy. He comes up and talks to you every day, says hi, how you doing? Very cool. That's what I noticed. I just met Joe today because we came in yeah. to feature him on the magazine. But he's really friendly and the stuff he's got is really creative. What do you think of the creativity of the place overall? Uh, I like it a lot. Uh, I remember I talked to him a lot, and uh, every time we come in, he's always telling me about this crazy new thing he's coming up with, and it's like, oh man, I gotta come in that day to try that stuff out. Alright, I'm here with Maurice at the Red Cadillac, so let me show you guys real quick. We're in Union, New Jersey, and Maurice, tell us a little more about what you do here and, and what you do for Welcome people. Welcome to the Red Cadillac. I'm Maurice. I'm the doorman. I greet everyone as they come in and leave. I ask everyone to have a pleasant evening while, while they uh, arrive. I also tell them that we may have live entertainment or a DJ. And, and when everyone is leaving, I ask them, how was their experience? How was your experience here at the Red Cadillac? And most every time, everyone says they've had a wonderful time. The food was absolutely amazing. And the, 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 uh, the tequilas were just great. Yeah, yeah first time. First time? Yeah. Welcome to the Red Cadillac. All right, thank I you. I hope you have a wonderful experience. The food is amazing. Everything is handmade. All right, we are and hungry. And we have the most incredible infused tequilas at our margarita bar. All right, thank you very much. Okay, so the address is? 2258 Morris Ave.